So in today's video, we're going to be talking about how to set yourself up so that you're basically recession proof. Now, this comes off of the heels of an article that Warren Buffett had wrote where he was talking about how to protect yourself from inflation. And nowadays, as you know, things are getting more and more expensive, right? And so the interesting part about this article was the advice that he gave, which was to become better at your skill, to become better at what you do, right? To try to become the best at what you do. And I thought that that was interesting because right now there is still a lot of uncertainty, right? We're in a part of, you know, post pandemic where the economy is starting to bounce back. But for a lot of creatives out there, for a lot of small businesses out there, businesses got basically decimated, right? Some went out of business, some are still struggling, some are still limping along, you know, just trying to get back into the game. And one of the things that we can do, right, as creatives, as entrepreneurs, okay, is to become better at what we do. All right, now I'm talking especially to creators, right? So I myself, I do video, I do photography, I do a couple of other things, but those are my main staples. That's how I really make my income. And the goal is, is to become better at what you do. You wanna actually try to become the best at what you do, right? Because when you're the best, people will seek you out, right? They'll look for your services, right? Or they'll wanna go with you and they'll be willing to pay the prices. Now, this is where this article really gets, um, this, is, this is the point that I think it really touches on, is that as you become better at what you do, the more you can charge for your goods and for your services, right? And so you always wanna be working to get better. Now, I know I said this in the past that you always wanna work and increase, and, and you, know, you always wanna be practicing your craft, but now is more important than ever, right? Because we're in a time where things are getting high. And so as the prices increase, all right, you kind of got to look at what you're doing. You're looking to cut corners or other people who you might be doing business with are looking to cut corners here and there. And the better you are at what you do, right? The better you are at your skill and your craft, then the more likely you are to win more business right now. There's other parts involved in that as far as marketing and promotion and all those other things I know, but I'm talking about strictly just the skill set right now. And essentially, when you get better, you can charge more money, right? And the more you make, right? The more, you know, you, you have to protect yourself and your lifestyle, right? Whether it's to be able to pay your bills, whether it's to be able to go out and buy the things that you wanna buy, right? And nowadays, even the basic necessities are becoming super expensive. And so we have to be able to keep up with that inflation, right? Now, the difference between a freelancer and somebody who has a job is that as a freelancer, you can continue to increase your value. Right now, when you have a job, you might be locked into a salary or you, may, uh, or you might be locked into an hourly rate. Now, you are starting to see increases in wages because you know you have the great resignation going on, people are quitting, they're going to different places, you know, and culture is really starting to matter. And so you have that going on, right? But as a freelancer, as somebody who has the ability to create and make more income, now is more important than ever to try to double down on what you're good at. Now for us creatives, I know that we can get sidetracked. We like to start new projects. We like to be all over the place and do all types of things because we like creating, we like bringing ideas to life. But when it comes to your main source of revenue, whether it's uh, photography, videography, graphic design, you're building websites, right? It doesn't matter. Right now is the time where you just wanna get better at what you do. So that way you can command top dollar, therefore protecting you from what's going on, you know, with these other factors that are out of your control, such as inflation. And so I just kind of thought that was really interesting because in an article like that, written by somebody like Warren Buffett, who people, you know, know for investing, right? You would think that he would say, take your money and move it here. And this would be a hedge against inflation, right? Or, or this way you can protect whatever, right? And so this way you're not losing money due to the rising cost of living. But I thought it was interesting that actually what he said, instead of, you know, do, you know, move your money to this type of stock or this type of asset class, is was that he really said double down on yourself. Double down on yourself, double down on your skill set, and become great at what you do. Okay, because when you do that, 
you can always reap the benefits, but more importantly, you can uh, continue to increase your prices and protect yourself from all these uncontrollable forces, right? These things that, you know, you can't control inflation and whatever else is going on. But what you can control is getting better at what you do, whether that's whatever skill it is that you have and getting better at promoting yourself. That's a whole different story. But as far as the skill set, the technicals itself, you want to become better at what you do. So that way you can always command top dollar. So that's it for me today. Thanks for sticking around if you made it this far in the video because this is the end. And for all my people out there who are trying to build a life on their terms and get it how they live, this is your man, Jonathan Moore, and I'm signing out. Peace.